Yeah, hello, I'm Billy Belcher from World Working Class and Houseless Organizing Alliance. Um, I am here tonight in disgust at the crimes that are being committed by the city and its police department in particular. As you know, um, after four Greensboro cops were arrested last year for committing sex crimes, a news and record reporter spent the last few months of 2023 investigating whether Greensboro cops were abusing sex workers. The results of that investigation were not published because of the actions of you and your cops. According to public records that you have released, uh, Police Chief John Thompson, City Manager Ty Jayoba, Assistant City Manager Trey Davis, and Communications Director Carla Banks should all be in fired and investigated for obstructing justice because they intentionally killed that investigation into police wrongdoing. The people of this city deserve Chief Thompson's head served up on a platter. If he is content running a gang of rapists, he needs to be removed immediately. It has long been common knowledge in Greensboro that the police department is a slimy, crime-ridden cesspool of racism and sexual violence. And it seems like the most important job that the city council and the city manager have is to shield the police department from accountability. There was no accountability for murdering Marcus Smith, no accountability for hog tying and torturing dozens of black women, no accountability for attacking unarmed people with police dogs, and now no accountability for sexual violence against especially vulnerable women. Mayor Vaughn, you have sanctioned every single piece of brutality this police department has delivered unto the people of this city. So I would end by asking you why it is acceptable to assault women if you're wearing a police badge. Why is the police chief allowed to tell reporters what to print? It is unacceptable. The police chief and the city manager have to go and the snake's nest over the police department needs to finally be cleaned up. Thank you.